Welcome to www.spiritualstepladder.co.uk This short film taken on the 27th of January 2012 shows an angel visitation in our home once again. As you are aware we have had many visitations over the last few years and I still am able to bring this fantastic uh, footage to you all. I have put some steel frames in here to show you how the angel is able to shapeshift and alter the shape as she moves around the room. There we are again and again that's a quite a good frame. The interesting thing when we have angel visitations, which I'm sure is more often than I'm able to film, well I know that is the case, the body of the angel or fifth dimensional being, however you want to understand what you're seeing, is always luminous or a luminous white um, truly from spirit absolutely no doubt about it there we are we've reverted now down to a small size and what's very interesting as well is at certain points in this film the angel is very small and at other points in the same position the angel is very very large which is amazing Um, we're increasing in size now um, and as we come up towards the ceiling there's another still frame there and down from the ceiling again and across over to the stairs and disappearing we're moving around the doorway And disappearing. Patience is one of the biggest virtues with mediumship, with this work. Patience is something you have to have. Without that, you cannot work from your heart. There we are. We're very tiny at the moment, moving over to the curtains and around that area and across the door. And as you can see there, there is a person in the doorway. There we are, across the rug. There we are, we're beginning to increase, increase in size as we get closer to the camera, obviously. Now, interesting here, because we have already seen the angel at this point in the room, in this place in the room, as we went as it went across the doorway, um, but initially it was very, very small, and now it's increased again in size, and obviously now at this moment it's disappearing. There we are. Amazing. I hear the doubters, 
I hear you say it's a moth. Well, if a moth survives through November, December and January in our times of real cold evenings where we have our central heating on and we need to keep warm 3.15 in the morning or the early hours of the morning, that's some moth. I know that it's not. But I leave that suggestion up to you. The Divine and Angelic Kingdom continue to bring me amazing things. And I am fortunate enough to be able to bring them to you. That's my role. That's what I've been chosen to do. So for now, I'll say goodbye to you all. And leave you to watch the rest of the film. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.